going to make mommy channel. I mean, mommy YouTube channel. And I'm going to show you my mommy plants. So here's the first plant. The second. The third one. But this is not a plant. The second and then the third one. So, I'm ready. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Thank you for being here and thank you for tuning in. Thank you for subscribing. So guys, today I want to show some of the plants that I got. I recently went for plant shopping in the video that you watched. Is, that, that is my that is my daughter. She just wanted to be part of this video. So I just let her be. So I just I want to show you the plants that I got. This is part one of this. I'll be I'll be doing plant shopping. Like this is part one of my plant shopping. And then in the second part you'll just see the plants that I get. But for for today I'll show the plants that I recently got and then I'll also show you um you see this plant over here. This one. I don't know if it can so guys this is the plant that I'm talking about. Um I've planted it in a in a plastic these are cut these are pot that I cut from a water bottle as you can see so I I got a I also got a, a pot a decent pot for it so let me show you as I transfer this plant from this pot to another um, to another pot So guys, I'm done transferring the pot, the plant. So as you can see, this is the pot. This is the pot, guys. It has some some dirt on it, some soil. Yeah, but that's how it looks. I know the plants of this, the leaves of this plant are a bit yellowish. But it's because I neglected it for for a while. I was not watering it and I was not also misting it, so that's why. But it's still it's going to recover in a few like in one week it's it will it will already have turned green, like the yellow color, this coloring will have changed in one week and I'm going to update you guys. I promise you. So yes, that's it. 
so that's the pot i like the color but i think i'm still going to paint it to white i don't know if white is okay either white or black because that's the name of this house black white but also this color because it's close to let me move <laughs> backwards a bit yeah there so as i was saying i don't know if i should paint this this spot white so as i was saying guys i don't know whether i'm going to paint this spot white or to just remain like that with that color because it's either i paint white or black because those are the two main colors in this house white black mesh road like all neutrals so I'm still thinking about it whether to paint it white or black or just to it, it remain like that. Maybe I'll just add a layer of varnish, clear varnish on it so it should look a bit <laughs> shiny, glossy, or matte. I don't know. Like, I just know what to do with it. So, yes, let me now show you the, the plant that I got. This one was already here. I've, I've, I've stayed with this plant for, for how long? I bought it last year last year when i can't remember when is it last year or early this year because i used to have i used to have a money plant a very big money tree money tree and then i give it out i don't know yes i give it out and then uh i've had so many plants in the previous house that you were that you were in in our previous house that is we had i had several plants some i gave out some died but just a few died i don't kill plants easily so most of them I give out. So right now I just want to buy to get back to where I was. I buy more plants, and I'm just getting started. So don't uh, this this is not one of the plants that I got. Yes, and this is a corn plant, and it's an indoor plant, and it's a very easy to maintain plant. So if you want to start this thing of having plants, indoor plants in your house. You can start with such plants and also the plant is over here. I'm going to show you. You can start with such a corn plant or money tree. Like you just say, I'll be updating you guys with what the kind of plants that are easy to the easy to easy to keep or easy to maintain plants for a beginner. Even if no matter how like how how what how not knowledgeable you are or how new you are with plants there's some plants that you can't afford to kill like this one this one it can stay for a whole month without water it can stay for for forever unless for you see for now for example this one i neglected it for for two weeks it drains water quickly so so i neglected it for i think even more than two weeks but it's still it's still okay but with a few yellowing on plant on the leaves but it's still okay another plant that is let me show you let me show you the plants that you can't afford to kill so this is one of them this is a peace lily this is not one of the ones that i got i'm just telling you some of the plants that you can't afford to kill this is a peace lily so i have stayed with this peace lily also for quite some time now but you see it has some symptoms of dying of yellowing like that it's because it doesn't like being moved from one place to another that's what i've been doing uh we we moved from you know we moved from the other house that we were in the reason why it's it's like this it's because we we have been moving it from one place to another trying to look for a for a place that it will fit well like it will look best and it will get the best place that you can get some light because it also she likes getting it likes sunlight but not direct sun so i found this the perfect spot for it it was on the other side of the tv stand so i moved it from on that side to this, to this side now and before moving it to this side it was on the countertop on the kitchen in the kitchen on the kitchen countertop so you see it has been moving from one place to another that's why it looks like that but it's still going to recover so yes that's one of the plants also that you cannot afford to kill but it also it's also a dramatic plant guys <laughs> like it's it's dramatic in 
in terms of uh yeah you can't move it from one area to another and that applies to all plants like all plants almost all plants the only plant that i know it's um you, you can still move it around and still not give signs of dying but still stagnate is this plant let me show you this is this is the snake plant the, so now this is one of the plants that i got this snake plant you see how cute it is this is the plant that i got and don't mind my tv stand guys i i i changed the look i changed the look of this uh this tv stand and i i accept that i didn't do it perfectly because i'm just a beginner in food work so yes and now let me show you the whole place how it looks my tv area so i have on that end i have my snake plant and then those are fake those are fake um, what are they called those are fake um those are fake gosh what are they called those are fake um, eucalyptus leaves those are fake ones and then now i have my peace lily over there and then now have my tree my indoor tree <laughs> over there so yes i love that so guys this is the this is the other plant that i got this is a money this is called a money tree but it's now it's the younger it's a younger version of money tree so i want to grow it until it grows tall <laughs> until it becomes like tall 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 so yes this is the other plant it's very young baby i was told i don't i can't remember it's how old but it's young as you can see it's very short this is the third plant guys it's a peace lily i love peace lilies peace lilies are my most favorite plant in the plants i love peace lilies guys with all my heart so i got this kayang peace lily it's it's still struggling to adapt to this environment because it's a new environment for it but i believe and i know it's going to adapt and it's going to grow well and they can't wait for it to grow until it starts to flower so yes guys you see how cute it is and then also about the bottle the bottle that i am using to mist it's a bottle that i had for it had rose water and then when i finished rose water i started using it for missing my plants because i didn't have a missing bottle and missing my plant is one of my favorite things to do in this house in fact it's my most favorite thing to do i can miss this plant even three times in a day i don't know whether it's healthy for plants but i can do it i can miss this plant i can miss my plants three times in a day as long as i'm in the house i will miss them as many times as possible so that's it for today guys thank you for watching and thank you for subscribing if you've not subscribed please subscribe to my channel like the video guys and i'll see you on my next video thank you guys bye bye <laughs>